I'm trained in, in, through my PhD actually in, uh, in, in turbulence, uh, both uh, numerical and theoretical work in turbulence, uh, and then moved in, uh, in epidemiology from uh, really an applied math perspective to modeling of, of diseases and, and, and infection. Um, and then came back to uh, fundamental fluid dynamics uh, when I saw the cross-linking between those two areas uh, of, of fluid dynamics and infectious diseases and uh, basically founded the Fluid Dynamics of Disease Transmission Laboratory where we look at multi-phase flows, interfacial flows, uh, mixing, uh, fluid fragmentation is a big activity in the lab uh, that pertain to complex and unsteady flows that are characteristic of pathogen dispersal in a range of indoor environments and diseases. Kathleen contacted me uh, when she was visiting in fact, Boston and we chatted about the idea uh, and I thought that this was really exciting uh, as, as a venue and myself publish, uh, you know, and, and, and hold dear the Journal of Food Mechanics uh, as, as really a very critical, uh, you know, venue to publish fundamental and, uh, and, and, and deep uh, research in fluid dynamics. But at the same time, uh, this was a very exciting idea where we would maintain those standards of, of rigor and depth of potentially fluid dynamics, but also where fluids can be applied. And, br and when new questions of fluid dynamics come about, about in a range of applications. And, and it's true that these type of interface uh, research between domains uh, don't always have a clear home. And bringing that closer to the Journal of Food Mechanics through this flow partner journal is, is fantastic because we could then maintain uh, the depth and rigor of fluid dynamics, yet also uh, bringing in, in exciting new avenues that maybe might not find a perfect home in the classical journals. I think, you know, I mean, exciting work on, on, on new physical processes that are pertaining to uh, environmental work or health work, or but, but a range of things. I am interested also in industrial applications and energy, but uh, I am quite particularly excited by problems that involve uh, interfacial flows, uh, multi-phase flows, uh, and uh, mixing processes or fragmentation. I'm, I'm very excited about those, but with the applications uh, that pertain uh, to health uh, and the environment and potentially emerging new areas uh, that, that interface with medicine would be uh, really exciting as well.